Hello, you are watching the special release of KC News. Representatives of the G20 states met in Berlin to find ways for the better consumer protection in a digital world. The motto of the two-day event was building a digital world consumers can trust. For the first time, the 20 leading industrialized countries and emerging economies have come together for a G20 consumer summit. Germany has declared the development of the digital economy and its consequences for a wide variety of fields one of the priority issues of its G20 presidency. The summit agenda pursued three goals – ensuring stability, enhancing viability and accepting responsibility in order to harness the onward march of digitalization as a driver of economic growth and social development. The ability to process huge volumes of data offer major opportunities for the working world, mobility and science. Speaking of digital technologies and G20, we couldn't ignore the speech by the Bundesbank president of the 9th annual G20 conference that took place on the 15th of March in Frankfurt am Main, Germany. Dr. Jens Weidmann said that the digitalization can boost competition in the financial sector, particularly as fintechs are making inroads into this sector. He noted that some central banks are researching the implications of blockchain technology, adding that the Bundesbank is among them. Furthermore, he emphasized on the regulation of fintechs, noting that several corporations using technology-enabled financial innovations operate either on a global scale or carry out a large number of cross-border transactions. As world governments still discuss potential applications of blockchain, blockchain-based projects help to make the world better. The World Food Programme will use the Ethereum to fight against hunger. The introduction of technology into the organization's work will help to reduce the speed of delivery, costs, risks and improve data protection. For the first time, the blockchain was successfully used by the Food Programme in January to send humanitarian aid to the Pakistani province Sindh. Article What is Blockchain and How it is Connected to Fighting Hunger published by the organization reports. The full potential of blockchains can only be realized if all humanitarian actors collaborate around this platform. Another Ethereum-based project aimed at the improvement of world breaks the record. On the 14th of February, Kronobank closed its ICO with over 5,400 bitcoins raised. On the current stage, time tokens purchased by bakers at ICO will receive rewards based on activity within the Kronobank ecosystem. Team of Kronobank asked timed holders to transfer their tokens to a mining contract balance so they would be eligible for these rewards. The revenue model for Kronobank is straightforward. Every time that labor hour tokens are issued or transacted, and every time workers get paid in the decentralized labor racks exchange, a small fee is incurred. The decentralized nature of blockchains means that these fees can be significantly smaller than those of a traditional recruitment agency. According to the official block of the project, the so-called mining rewards approach was chosen in order to distribute fees to time holders. Kronobank's team claims that it might be technically simpler to dividend them out to holders. Uber made a revolution in taxi business by allowing anyone to become a taxi driver. Drivers cash in their spare time for extra money and customers get a cheaper ride. Similarly, Upwork has created freelance industry by connecting professionals and their clients outside of traditional agencies. Chronobank will do the same with real-world professions that currently use recruitment, outsourcing or labor hire companies. E-commerce, warehousing, industrial, building, cleaning and more. Anyone will be able to sell labor time in their given profession making it easy and low cost to recruit talent and pay for their services without any middleman. The first stage of our project is to create multi-blockchain labor hours, sustainable, stable coins that are protected from inflation. In contrast to national currencies, labor hours will be backed by real labor time provided by major recruitment companies around the world. The second stage is to create Labor X, decentralized marketplace where people in the real-world professions will be able to sell their labor time to anyone without middlemen, just as easily as Uber drivers or Upwork freelancers do. Get on board at the beginning of the revolution in recruitment with Chronobank. In the recent blog post, Chronobank's team introduced the model of the labor rights reputation system. Unlike other online community services, LaborX, in addition to the commonly used roles of worker and client, has another three roles. 
evaluator, verifier and provider. Together, they will serve the purpose of recommenders. More details on the reputation system of decentralized exchange labor regs is available on blog.cronobank.io. Cronobank partners with Explorer. Cronobank will be implementing Explorer's API within their Chrono wallet to gain the information required to conduct a range of time token operations. To date, Cronobank time token maintains this strong position within the top 10 Ethereum tokens by activity for 90 days. Unlike other cryptocurrency platforms, Ethereum's tokens are not built directly in its blockchain. Instead, they exist as small contractors that can be programmed on a variety of different ways. The practical upshot of this is that although the result might superficially look the same, a token that can be transferred or traded freely, under the surface a very different mechanism is in action. Explorer's API will be used to acquire information about Ethereum tokens, contracts, transactions and custom structures within the Chrono wallet. Adopting Explorer's API will significantly speed the development of Chronobank's wallet and offer features that might otherwise have taken weeks or months to develop. Sergey Sergienko, CEO of Chronobank, comments We are very impressed with Explorer's functionality and particularly their powerful wide-ranging API. Time is leaking into the cracks and it's up to you to decide how to use all that is left. As Warren Buffett says, Someone is sitting in the shade today because someone planted a tree a long time ago. Check out coronabank.io and watch KC News. See you soon.